For any restaurant worth its salt, empty tables means bad news. Here at CJ's near Falmouth, owner Paul realised how big a problem he was facing as he prepared for Easter Sunday. We had 200 people booked and we had 46 no-shows, which you know, is 25% of, of the entire bookings for the day. Um, and like I said, I went home that evening and I was thinking, oh, what do I do about this? What can we do? And my wife Sarah says to me, like, well, don't do anything on social media. It just sort of looks a bit petty. But feeling increasing frustration, Paul posted on the restaurant's Facebook page, telling his followers that he and his wife felt ever so slightly scammed. The post went viral and sparked a huge reaction from fellow business owners. I just want to highlight how important it is to actually cancel your booking. If you've got the time to pick up a phone and make the reservation, then cancel it. Some restaurants do insist on taking a deposit from customers when they book. Paul does this for large groups, but he says it doesn't solve the problem. Yeah, I've got a deposit for them, but what I haven't got is the three gas heaters that I've got burning fuel back to me. I haven't got my two staff that essentially I could have sent home. It's becoming significantly harder to run small businesses with the cost of energy rising, the cost of bills rising, the food costs rising. Small businesses can't perform if people don't show up and support them. And it's not just restaurants. No shows affect all sorts of different businesses in towns like Falmouth. So we've been asking people here today, have you ever made an appointment and then simply not shown up? Never done that and I don't agree in it at all. It's really hard for the restaurateurs, isn't it? Have you ever booked an appointment and then not shown up? Personally, I haven't, but I've worked in um, places before that, that it has happened and it's a bit um, annoying, I suppose. Um, it's bad for the business, especially if it's a small business. It's disgusting. It is. Why can't you just ring up and say you're not going to come? And it's not fair. I think they're just a bit rude, really. Yeah. The boss of Cornwall's Chamber of Commerce says if this continues, then all restaurants may need to start taking deposits for every booking. If you're genuine about it, to put down a £50 uh, or £20 deposit isn't going to be a problem. If you're flaky, then it'll sort you out at that moment. Won't it? So I, I would recommend a £20 deposit refundable if it's over 24 hours notice, I think is reasonable. So whether it's a meal, a haircut or even a taxi ride, make sure to call if you need to cancel to avoid being another annoying no-show. Sam Blackledge, ITV News, Falmouth.